on WBZ News, today marks 10 years since the Boston Marathon bombings. Three people were killed and nearly 300 injured when the explosions rocked Boylston Street. The city of Boston commemorating the solemn anniversary with a day of ceremonies and service. Today's events kicked off with the ceremonial wreath laying at the memorial sites. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Jordan Jagelinzer. Ken McLeod is off tonight. WBZ's Paul Burton brings us the sights and sounds of one Boston day. One Boston day was filled with emotional moments of reflection and remembrance, powerful images of hope and love. As families, city officials, and communities mark the 10-year anniversary of the Boston Marathon bombings. On Saturday morning, joined by local leaders, loved ones of the victims attended a private wreath-laying ceremony at the two spots on Boylston Street where the bombs went off. It was incredibly moving to be with the families this morning. This is a significant day, significant weekend for the city of Boston and, and truly for the state of Massachusetts. The day was also filled with service and spreading acts of kindness. I think it's just recognizing that each individual person has a power to encourage peace and hope. 14-year-old Adam Cheers is part of Project 351. This weekend, in partnership with the Martin Richard Foundation, he, along with dozens of other teens, took part in a day of service at City Year. Students from all 351 cities and towns are joined together in the same spirit and in the same mission of Martin Richard. Young people spent the day making kindness blankets for the Pine Street Inn and building care packages for first responders and planting flowers that were passed out to families impacted by the tragedy. This has been life-changing. Um, it has been just so eye-opening to see, um, to be part of the community, to be, see like from start to finish, to recognize a need, um, to realize that you can change. The theme for Project 351 this year is embrace hope, unity, and love. And these incredible acts of kindness that are taking place all throughout the city on this one Boston day will have a huge impact on the days and weeks ahead. Realizing the individual power to make change. A powerful day of service filled with the spirit of peace, unity, and love. In Boston, I'm Paul Burke, WBZ News.